Hi everyone, this is the video number 4 of our ethical lagging using Kali Linux video series and in this video we will talk about how to install Kali Linux on your computer. So let's get started. Basically there are many methods to install Kali Linux like install Kali Linux on virtual machine install Kali Linux dual boot with windows and install Kali Linux full version on your computer. Now we will understand these points in detail. First install Kali Linux on a virtual box. In this method you don't need to format your previous operating system and you can use both operating systems Linux and windows and you can also install multiple operating system in a computer. Basically in this method you need to install a software to run Kali Linux or other operating systems. Then install Kali Linux dual boot with windows. In this method you can install Kali Linux operating system using a pen drive without delete your previous operating system. And in this method you only need to create a bootable drive and install Kali Linux on your computer. Then install Kali Linux full version. If you have a low hardware or low configuration computer then you need to follow this method to install Kali Linux. In this method you need to create a bootable drive and install Kali Linux on your computer. And in this method you also need to delete your previous operating system. But in this video I will tell you step by step how to install Kali Linux on a virtual box. And if you want to tutorial on other methods then comment me down. I will also make a specific video on that. Now to install Kali Linux on a virtual box there are 7 steps. First download a virtual box named VMware workstation. Then download Kali Linux ISO file. Install VMware on your computer. Create a new virtual machine. Customize hardware. Install Kali Linux and use Kali Linux. And now I will tell you these methods step by step. First of all open your browser and search VMware download. Then open the first site then you will see a screen like this. Then click here to download VMware on your computer. Then for download Kali Linux ISO file search Kali Linux download on your browser. Open Kali Linux official site then click on download button. Then you will see a screen like this. Then just click on it and click here to download Kali Linux ISO file for VMware workstation. Then after install VMware, open it, then you will see first view like this. Now you need to click on create a new virtual machine, then select typical and click on next. Now you need to select Kali Linux ISO file, so select installer disk image file, then click on browser, then select your Kali Linux file from download folder, then open and then click on next. Now here select Linux and here Ubuntu 64 bit. Then next and type here your username anything. In my case my username is Kali. After this click on next. Now type here approximate 30 GB or more. Then select store virtual disk as a single file. Then click on next. Now here you can see the location, version, operating system, hard disk and memory size. If you want to change anything then click here. Otherwise click on finish. Now you are ready to use your Kali Linux operating system. Then to start Kali Linux click on power on this virtual machine. Then you will see a screen like this, then this and then this. In this window type your username Kali and next. Then your operating system will boot and then you will see a screen like this. And now you can use your Kali Linux operating system on your computer. And to login Kali Linux, the default username and password like this. Username Kali or root. Password Kali root or password. Try these all to find your username and password. And if you like this video, hit the like button. And if you have faced any kind of problem while installing Kali Linux, then paste your problem in comment section or Instagram DM. And don't forget to subscribe this channel. So that is enough for this video. See you again in the next video.